25 hours. My name is Paul Serene. I founded Monarch Solutions 17 years ago with a very clear purpose. There are those who would question my actions. I'm recording this as a final statement of vindication, a testimony of how things came to be. I've always been devoted to my mission, never deterred from my goal, no matter the sacrifice, because I've seen where this leads. I've seen where it all ends. We have a problem. No word from Jack Joyce's transport. It should have arrived here by now. We may have a traitor on the inside. You're due for your treatment. I'll find who's behind this. Find Jack. That's our priority. Get your best man on it. There's more. As you know, Jack's level of interference led to unexpected complications. Witnesses from the university were transported here. You need to take a look. Man, he's such a good actor. You can't afford any further obstacles at this stage of the plan. Now, I see two options. We could use force, remove any loose ends. But if those witnesses disappear, the public will start asking questions, potentially turn on Monarch. All clear, sir. Alternatively, I could mount a broad PR strategy, get the city on our side. But that leaves us with the, the loose ends. Precisely. The choice is yours, but keep in mind, the men will view your decision as a unified strategy moving forward. Man, I miss you. Thanks, Commander Zavala. I needed that pep I needed a pep talk. Or just actually just to hear your voice. <laughs> I want this delivered to my office. What is it? A reminder. Ah. Huh. That's a ripple? Seriously, how did they get this thing out of the out of the lab? How long until the core is ready for transport? It'll be en route to Monarch headquarters in less than an hour. Installation should be complete before the gala. Good. Also, what are these guys wearing? Jack would never understand the necessity of what I'd done. It wasn't the death William deserved. But his knowledge posed too great a risk to our plan. It was the first ground time I'd zero. visited the Ground Zero operation in ages. The location I'd arrived in when I went 17 years back in time. The location where my fate was sealed six years ago. We had Jack in custody, but I was starting to witness visions from the future which made it clear that could change very soon. Oh, really? Like what? Sir. Who is this? Amy Ferrero. She's one of the witnesses. Awaiting your orders on how to proceed. My powers grew stronger, even as the Cronon Syndrome worsened. I could choose a path that would become the actual future. But it wasn't optional. The moment wouldn't end until I made up my mind. Oh, this is why it's junction impacts. Okay. There's a live action show. All right, let's see what they what it's like. Any potential threats to our plan need to be erased. Wait. Monarch would take a hardline approach. Crush all obstacles, eliminate all witnesses. It would be harsh. But I had made hard choices for the greater good before. I dug through the area and I found everything I could on your bro. Action driver? This is messed up, man. I trusted Monarch. But the people of Riverport would turn against us. You murderer! Our secrets would be safe, but the public would hate us. And Jack would gain new allies. 
Monarch's got no authority to stop you, and you tell that to everybody on that bridge. Hmm. What's PR? Initialize a PR campaign. I want to sting you. And that violence was because of Jack Joyce. Monarch would take a PR-friendly approach and manipulate the public into siding with us. Our lies would give us control. The manhunt continues as authorities search for Jack Joyce. Hey, somebody sneaking around down there. Hey, I think that's Jack Joyce! We'd use the media to expose, then hunt for Jack. I uploaded all the files I stole on that USB stick from the Monarch security station. But the eyewitnesses would be out there, and Jack would learn our secrets. Okay, so I get to choose this. Okay. That's kind of cool. Um, well, in this case, I'd rather go with PR. We can't risk any unwanted attention. Convince the witnesses not to talk. Keep eyes on them and send them home. Initialize a PR campaign. We need the city on our side. Yes, we do. Not this one. She's the head of the anti-monarch movement. I think we're looking at the new face of our campaign. Think so? Jack! There's no other way out. I'm going through the machine. Oh, wait. No! Jack! This way! Jack! Flashback. Where's the flash forward? I don't know. I use my power to guide us. To decide how to best prepare for the inevitable end of time. That gives the chosen few a chance to survive. I've seen the end of time. Kind of curious. Oh, it tells you which ones also chose. 76% so of the community agreed with my choice. And also chose the same thing. Nice. Okay, let's see what this is. Time's up. The one in the middle. I assume that's your mother. On the left, of course, your father. And on the right, the little one. How old is she? This is messed up, man. Come on, Zavala, you're better than this. One fourteen Lafayette. Is that correct? That was taken not five minutes ago by my associate, Michael. What do you want? I want a statement. And you don't want Michael outside of your house a moment longer. Messed up, man. Cool how this is like an actual live action scene, though. What happens to me? Well, that's entirely up to you. Is it? I'm so glad we could work this out. Man, I really hope this works out. That she stays alive. According to that future she does, but I really hope she actually does. Okay, just a portable green screen. I'm not jealous at all. Um... I'm pretty sure you need a different type of thing for this. 
What's with the eye drops? Okay, and now we're just whispering to each other. That's fine. And that's cool. Liam. Walk with me. Uh, okay, Zavala. Seems your work's been undone. We just lost communication with Jack Joyce's transport. I know his name's I uh, Zavala. That Knowing how is in the you just need to find him. Wincott is working on a location. Great. What is it? What? Something's wrong. I mean, yeah, we broke time. University. That's not how we operate. It was sloppy. Yes, it was. Have all your operations gone smoothly? I don't know. Go home, Liam. Wait for the call. Oh, great. Now I'm just an on-call guy. I'm sure your wife misses you. Oh, he's married. Okay. X. Two hours after fracturing time. Okay, so we're getting some time forward time back here. Me editing at a computer. There's Dan. Uh, what are you doing? Good thing about our friend Stan is Stan makes it easy. See, the guy goes around using the same username and password everywhere he goes. Now, <laughs> that means that his cloud isn't so protected. X. May I present to you Exhibit A. Oh boy. <laughs> wow. That's pretty bad. God, this guy's swinging for the fences. And the... what is that? What are you doing, Bear? Coffee what? Cup. No, I know it's a coffee cup, but what is it doing on my table? The fuck? Hey, just coffee, man. You know what this is? Do they have these in oh. Idaho? I will. Whatever. Use it. You tell me what's next, Brenner? Uh, I don't know. I know you don't know, and that makes me sad for you. All we do now is upload our girl's video to Stan and our friends at WZWY, send Stan a note with some of his private pics. Blackmail. And last but not least, we post a letter. That letter allows Reclaim to take full responsibility for everything that's happening. Signed sincerely, your local terrorist, Jack Joyce. Dang. You can say it. It's pretty Dang. awesome. <laughs> Shit. Oh man, the boss is calling. Better pick it up. Mr. Hatch, perfect timing. Me and Brenner, we just dug up some major dirt on uh, <laughs> on our news director over at WZWI. Yeah, you did. He'll be uh, he'll be running our copy and posting that girl's video within an hour. Good work, Woodcut. Where are we with Joyce? Joyce? Uh, well, I I got a lock on his transpo. I'm mean, I've hacked into his camera. And I'm waiting to find a locale. Really? It's not it's not it's not incredibly easy. Keep an eye on it. And when you find easy. Him, contact Burke directly. I think we have a traitor in our midst. Oh, traitor. Hello? Hello, man. But I'm gonna let you go, Mr. Hatch. Thank All right, I gotta play cool. Yeah, play cool. Was that Martin? Yes. Hatch? Get the fuck out of my office. You didn't even answer his question. Get the fuck out of my office. Just... I'm pretty sure I also kind of look like this guy right now. Fuck are you? Hmm? Where the fuck? Give me something. Come on. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. I guess we'll find out later in the game. Still, two hours after fracturing time. This is still pretty cool how it actually looks like a legit cinematic scene. I like this. Yeah, no guns in the house. Put on a different jacket. Like, that's gonna make a difference. Oh, it's a button-up shirt. Excuse me. It's a button-up jacket. Ah, oh, she's a little upset. I think she's worried. Yeah, she's worried. Come on. Use your words. Things have been really bad at work. I'm sorry. You just, just actually talk to the woman. I dreamt you were a cat. A cat. Why? A cat. Mm -hmm. <laughs> With these big furry bear paws. Way too big for your body. What the heck is going on in your head? It was a strange creature. But I knew it was 
next year. That's weird. All right, whatever you say. I have to get back to work soon. No, he literally just said, just wait for the call. We're on call. Just stay here. You work more than any field manager in the history of field managers. Is this technically the responsibilities of a field manager? I don't know. But... Baby, you haven't been home in two days. Bro, she's still here after you haven't been home in two days? What's wrong with you? Seriously? And you're married to this woman. Your mom's being difficult. Oh, she's pregnant. I'm, I'm, she is. I'm being she's, being, huh? she's being very difficult. <laughs> what happened? Um, <laughs> what? I don't think that's the baby. Oh, yeah, no. Okay. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Okay. You would. Did she stay up all night? <laughs> I feel like she stayed up all night. Close your eyes. Uh. Okay, I thought I was gonna have to censor this whole this whole thing here. Ah, uh, well, there's the call. Is it my phone or is it your phone? It's okay. Oh, yep, that's it's my phone for the call. Okay. Hey, I know I just saw you for like five minutes, but I already gotta go. Sorry. Yeah. Berg, you gotta lead on Joyce. What is it? I was able to track his transpo to a warehouse on Burgundy and Wilkins. It's inside Ground Zero Perimeter. Oh man. Sending you the coordinates now. Oh, hi. What are you gonna do? You gonna tell her? You should tell her. You should have that talk with her. I gotta go. Bro, just have that. You could have talked to her, man. 1999? Ah, there's an Alan Wake book next to the TV. In order to rebuild this great city, transforming it into an economic powerhouse Dang. over the past... And time stopped right there. Now what's gonna happen? Okay, but we can still hear the bicycle. Oh, everything stopped in the city, okay. Okay, who's on the other end of that frisbee? You trying to run after this bus? Oh yeah, he is. He missed the bus. That's what happens when you sleep in, kid. Don't miss the bus. Okay. Oh, that's weird for a seagull to do that. Yeah, we, we broke time and physics, everybody. That's not good. Paul is at just the center of it. Awesome. And he's got a weird, evil look on his face. That's even better. Okay. Still has an evil look. and has helped eager students from all over the country okay. to further their dreams and interest in technological research and design. Okay. And with Monarch's greatest investment in the future being right here in Riverport, it's pretty clear how bright the future is for all of is us. Is it though? Is it really though? Paul, there's been a Oh. Jack, you've already seen it. Tonight on the island, he'll be there and he'll want revenge. I need him stopped now. I think I'll Did you change to a different suit? Or is that the same suit? Your fifth calm traitor? You shouldn't take it so lightly. Joyce got lucky. He escaped. He's gone. He wouldn't be foolish enough to come back. Our only vulnerability is within, Paul. You should You're see talking. It. Telling me what I've already there seen. There you go. You're not thinking clearly. You need to finish my sense. I was going to say he was talking to the guy who sees, who literally sees the future. In the face of Monarch for all these years, Martin. Let's get clear on something. This is still my ship. Oh, dang. And I simply don't want to see you go down with it. Just fine. This is honest. We take you now to Riverport University, where a violent showdown shook the town last night. Joining us now.
now is Amy Ferraro, an eyewitness on the scene. Amy, tell us what is going on here. Okay, now where are we? Oh, we're actually in Warwick again. Okay. Things got very. Wow, they really uploaded that fast. And that violence was because of Jack Joyce. Oh boy. I want people to know. Okay, who is that? that he is very also, is that a butterfly person. tattoo on her neck? A terrorist. Two bacon and egg sandwiches. That'd be interesting. Thanks. Or is that just another time travel reference because it's, you know, every time a butterfly flaps its wings? Something about that. I don't remember the whole thing. University this morning. Someone solved the equation. Huh? Yeah. Oh, hey, that was uh, Will, who solved the equation. With local police to hopefully expedite the search for Jack Joyce and keep the people of Riverport safe as this very unsettling story continues to unfold. Um, okay. Oh, she's got another tattoo. Is that, was that a barbed wire around her wrist? Sup, IT. And you wish I was IT. Hey, you don't have security clearance being here. Security clearance. Access granted. I thought you might have been up all night, so... I mean, yeah. You didn't get the runny kind, did you? No, it shouldn't be. Damn. It's cool, they're new. Really? Still put oh, just man. shoes on the, the desk? Miller. Terminated. You're Damn. fired. So what's the, what's the 411? What the hell's going on out there? <laughs> the 411. Yeah, the 411. <laughs> uh, everything's, everything's fine. Sure, everything. Everything's sure fine. Is. Everything's fine. There was a shootout at the university last night. Nothing I couldn't handle. You weren't there. All right. You think they're going to cancel the party tonight? Are you kidding? No way. Hatch knows what he's doing. I hope so. You going to go? To a party? Me? Go to a party. Yeah, dude. Uh, we can roll together if you want. Oh, man. Do it. Go. Go to the party. OK. Yeah. All right, I'll, I'll go. There you go. Okay, buddy. Uh, what are you gonna wear? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe, uh. Maybe I'll go next. Oh, that's a full choice. Nice, I like that. Um, I gotta get back to my desk, so. See you tonight? Yeah. That's. Okay. I don't think you want to tell her that. See you tonight. Yep. Buddy. Yep. Buddy. Same, dude. I, I, I felt that from here. All right, now where are we at? Still two hours after time back here. Also, I just want to point out, that's a pretty nice car. But you might want to trade up. You're going to have a family soon, man. All right, they're in Massachusetts. That's a Massachusetts plate. I don't know if anybody saw that. Oh man. Uh, might want to turn around. There we go. Then we have ourselves here a standoff. Liam, this isn't what it looks like. Fuck, Beth. Pretty sure it is what it looks like. I really didn't want it to be you. You need to listen to me. Step away from what the. What are band. these two relationship? Step away! Right now! Okay, they just colleagues. Drop Did she the train gun. him? Did I he train her? How did this work? You have three seconds till I pull. You have better reflexes. Then you're a marksman for shit. Oh, dang, really? Oh. No. No! And I'm gone. Gosh. He's gone. Oh, sorry, I should say Jack's gone. The starters. More and more. Beth, Beth, what is what is going on? Time is breaking down. How do you know this? The end is coming, and Joyce could be the key. Wait, 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 wait the, the, the end, the end of what? I don't know. Beth, the end of what? The of end time, of what? Of time, of time, of life as we know it. The entire universe Dang. gone, and somehow, Monarch has been preparing for it. Again, how do you know this? They knew it was coming. There's this thing. It's called a lifeboat protocol, uh, and okay. it can save us, at least some of us. Hands on your head, down on your knees. Brown. Wilder, do not make me ask again. Oh, hey guys, where'd you come from? Joyce just took down half my men. You think maybe he had some help? Maybe. We're unarmed. I was responding I to not a give call. a fuck. I am with Monarch. On your knees! If they take me in, then it's the end for me. And for you. Uh, obviously. Down! I'm just do what he says. Do not let them take us. 
We'll never find the lifeboat. Think about Emily. Oh dang. Just relax. Used to wipe. Liam. Shut up! Wow. Okay. Nice. Nice. Okay. This lifeboat protocol. Yeah, what, what is, is it? it? I don't know. But Dr. Kim was at the center of it. Dr. Kim? If you can get into his lab. That's impossible. We know the other stuff, but not that. It's been closed up since he disappeared. Do you know anyone who could get you in? That's the look. He's like, I know a guy. It's this guy. Come on, of course it's this guy. Guys. 29 down. 40 more to go. Yep. I understand that feeling. Yeah. More. Bro, I feel like that would be cold by now. Ah, you got it all over your desk, Thanks, Fiona. It's disgusting. Oh. oh. Holy. Ah, man. Lambert. Don't do it, man. Ah, oh, dude. Dude. Got gotcha, buddy. Yeah, he's gonna do it. Crap. That's just gonna love this. Oh, now it's three after. Oh, three hours shit. after. Okay. I thought it was still like two boy. hours. I'm like, how did they get this in real time? Oh, hey, look. Anybody saw that? Uh, it's gonna go on uh, Paul's desk. Oh, food truck. Cool. There's a gnat flying next to me somewhere. Charlie. Oh. I need a favor. This is awkward. Yeah. Okay. Um, could we talk somewhere private? Oh boy. That's uh, awkward. It's really rather not. But in your office would be good. It'll be really quick. Yeah. Um. Uh, this is re gonna be really awkward. So what happened with Joyce? Oh, there's nothing there. Huh? There's nothing there. He like he just wasn't there. Like. Or what? No, Hatch, he, um, he reassigned me. He wants me to secure the perimeter lab on the island. He thinks Joyce might go okay. there. Okay. He sent me here to get access to it. Can you help me out? Yeah, sure. Uh, let, me, uh, let me see what I can do. Uh, Thank you. Is, is there a panic button in this office that this guy's gonna hit? You know, it's really funny that you say that, uh, that lead on Joyce was no good because, I don't know, uh, it sure looks like he was there. And that other guy kind of looks like you, but that's weird because oh, dude. you work for Monarch, and that guy clearly, <laughs> clearly does not work for Monarch. Oh, boy. Yeah, I can zoom in. Hey, hey, wait, stop killing me, because I just put a high security alert out on your ass. You got about 20 seconds. You're hey, welcome. dude. Hey, you're welcome to stick around and try to find out. You know what I'm going to do to you. I have a pretty good idea what Monarch's going to do to you. In about 15, 14. Really? Go with the countdown, 13. really? 12, 11, Sorry, I don't my phone for a second. Good luck, buddy. Nine, eight. We need all points converged on Liam oh, Burke. He's boy. armed and dangerous. Okay, how are you gonna get out of this building? You just showed everyone that you're a Listen badass, up, but how B are you gonna get out of this building? Just reminders, oh boy. Get your flu shot. Why would you go to HR to get flu shots? I never understand that. Is that a thing? Is that a common thing? Okay. Oh boy. Oh boy. Dang, dude. Fucking idiots! Yeah, where's the other guards? Oh, there's the other Damn, guards. Stop! I was gonna say, the first two are like security guards. Here's the actual arm guard. Oh, dang. Alright, dude, run. He's not invincible. He's not a fucking superhero. Brenner, I'm dealing with it. Yeah, I know. 
I know. <laughs> He's in the building. Yeah. Yeah, I got it, Brenner. Cool. Oh, dang. Run, dude. South parking structure. I repeat, south parking structure, fourth floor. Run. All right. Now use use the speed of that car. Hit the gas. Ah, oh, you could have drifted that there. Come on, what are you doing? Pretty sure you have tactical driving. See, look, you did a drift right there. You drifted right there. Second floor. You gotta cut him off. You guys, like easier said than done, dude. Okay, see, there's the tactical driving. He does not have it. Nice drift. He's heading out the entrance. Wasn't a full drift, but nice. Oh boy. You didn't shoot at him? Why? Also, where are we? I don't feel like this is Seattle still. Okay, he said he's south on Eastman, south on Eastman. Although I've never been to Seattle myself, so I have no idea. Hit the gas, man. Phantom team, he's headed to you. He's flying, look out. Copy. Cut him off, cut, go. Yeah, dude. What are you, what are you doing giving directions? Come on, you got this. Yeah, hit the gas. Hit the gas. He also has Massachusetts plates. Get me alongside him. Okay, his car is not bulletproof. I highly doubt that it's bulletproof. Nice. Okay. See? You gotta outdrift him, man. That's all you gotta do around those tight corners is outdrift him. They can't do that. Third Street, he's headed to the alley. Copy that. There you go. Corin. Uh. Uh. That's the wrong way. What are you doing? What are you doing, dude? There's no way. There's no way. Okay, there you go. I'm like, you're a badass, but no, you, he, not, not from that, not from that, man. Live to fight another day. Nice.